Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is episode number 32. Now we are gonna be doing weekly mystery signings in today's episode, as you guys can see from the title thumbnail and the screen. So yeah, let us get into this without any further ado. This is gonna be a short episode as a usual mystery signings, as you guys know. This is part 29 or 30 of mystery signings alone. And we have been doing this since the first RTG series, which was Magic Mount. And now we are in Hitman Highland. So we are having a decent... Oh, we get 90 centre-back Guardiol for our first player, which is not bad. Which is not bad. Guardiol is a good player. So I am happy with it. I am happy with it. Now we get a 90 rated centre-forward. I don't... I'm not going to be taking a centre-forward. So I think I'm going to get our 90 rated centre-back because i'll show you guys uh thales magno is a second player from mls i'll be honest guys i don't like mls uh card design i really don't like the mls card design it is so basic it is not good at all whatsoever but yeah we'll go to our team misty signings team as you guys can see this is how the team looks like as of now 90 rated team 89 mil the team is worth and we have some of the players that i had i have used them in some exchanges so don't mind that but just looking at the starting 11 it looks decent it looks decent i am still waiting on a good goalie because it has been woeful we have not got any goalies so far uh this cobal card is literally the only person you have got so far so hopefully at least the next one will have a good goalie but apart from that, the team is looking really nice. Now, even if I get Guardiol, I don't know who, who I'll be replacing him with. I think I have to remove him. McAllister is decent. Decent start. I mean, both the centre-backs we have right now are decent started. So, I think this week is not that exciting. This week's mystery signing is a bit very it's a bit basic. I'll be honest. I'll be honest. So, we have an MLS player. And we have a UCL uh, body hole. I feel like 90% of the people who actually care about Misty signings. I mean, 90% of the people who play this game don't care about Misty signings. But I feel like the people who care about Misty signings, 90% of you guys will be going for body hole. And if you guys are even new to the game, I feel like going for a good center back is the way to go. Center forwards are not a good position to go for guys. Trust me, center forwards are not a good position to go for. There are very, very less formations with the center forward positions. And they, most of them are not really that great. You can use 4-3-3, false 9, which has a center forward in it. But center forward is basically a uh, cam. So if you go for a striker, that will be good. Go for center backs, go for left back, right back. Uh, go for strikers, go for center attacking mids, CDMs. These are all good positions you should always have. So we have got Guardiol and apart from that, we have got ourselves this milestone rewards. Now, usually I will go for this 91 Mascheranos 2 and then the tradable 90 rated card. I am still going to go with that because I am in need of a lot of Mascherano cards. We have been getting cards left, right and center guys. Even if you guys saw the previous video which is the Sunil Chetri one and the Free Pele one. We need a lot of Master Runners because we, are being, we have been getting insane cards for free and I need to upgrade them. We get, we get, we get a, wait, we get a welcome Ferez icon, okay. This is good, this is good. I can sell him maybe or I'll just keep him and use him in exchanges. He's only going for 3 mil anyway. But if you guys want to have a look at my main squad and the RTG squad, this is how the main squad is looking as of now. After bringing in C3, I have upgraded him from 94 to 96 and I am waiting for training transfer so that I can transfer the trainings. And then the RTG squad, we had a 98 rated squad and yeah, if I remove, if I, imagine, if I remove just Adam Militao, it goes to 97, wait a minute. What, what is this weird glitch that has happened here? Just now it was at 97 with the same squad. This game is broken guys. Sometimes I just wish they would fix certain things. But this is how the team is looking. Now once training transfer comes, I'll bring in uh, Del Piero at center attacking mid position as well. 100 rated Del Piero. 
but yeah the team is looking decent we have uh, Hoyland at 92 uh, we might upgrade him we might upgrade him but so far so good we have the 98 uh, rated Valverde as well or 97 rated Valverde which I have upgraded to 99 which I, I am waiting for training transfers to upgrade all these players but uh, I hope you guys enjoy this video I hope you guys are enjoying the uh, FIFA mobile videos or the FC mobile videos uh, I will I will catch you guys in the next one make sure you guys check out the channel a lot of videos are being uploaded even we are even playing uh, UFA Euros 24 from FC 20 uh, FC 24 we are doing live live uh, back to glory on that on our twitch channel you guys can head over there also and check it out all that good stuff i'll see you guys in the next one guys take care stay safe stay motivated and keep smiling bye